Honor Club, where honor is real. What we're about to do right now is um, going to be painful. He is the soon-to-be two-time Ring of Honor World Champion, and he is I, and I am him, and I'm Matt Taven. And I really don't understand why I said yes to do this. But we are going to watch my very first match on the main card for Ring of Honor. I had been in dark matches before, about a year earlier. I had been in some dark matches when they came to Boston, but this was the very first time that I was gonna be on the main show, and man, did I disappoint everyone. Which is why I was glad that this, this match really didn't see much light of day, but now we're gonna put it out for the internet to see, and it's like, why are all my, my worst memories and the worst things I've ever done all on the internet? I don't know, I don't know. At this point, I was only about two years in. I mean, I had been on the New England independent scene, but this match took place in Plymouth, Massachusetts, Obviously, I'm from Boston, where I am right now. Plymouth isn't too far away, so this was kind of like a hometown affair for me. My family was in the crowd, giant sign that says Tavenville, and um, and I really just kind of pooped the bed. It's, uh, it's, it's bad. I mean, I haven't watched it since it happened. This will literally be the first time I've ever watched it, ever. And um, if my memory serves me correct, I, I don't... I don't want to watch this, but um, you know, what's better in quarantine than enjoying my misery? I guess nothing. Oh, and right away, right away with the baby oil. Oh my goodness, look at those chesticles. I need to bring the baby oil back, I think. I don't know, am I just the, the lighting? And, and the ladies! The ladies always loved Matt Taven. Beautiful blonde girl. I've never been on a Ring of Honor show. I'm not even sure who that is, to be honest with you. But kiss right from Matt Taven as soon as he walks through the door. I look at me trying to act like I didn't just fling all my hair in the face. There you go. Move it subtly. Giant sign that says Tavenville. That's all my family out there. Sid Reeves, my tag partner. Um, good guy. I really... Haven't talked to him much, I think, since this night. I, I, I'm not sure if he continued in wrestling. And uh, I think <laughs> right away you can tell between the two entrances who's um, on the roster and who isn't. Because the star power that just came through the curtain, or just the feeling, the confidence, you know, the attitude compared to us um, is, is leaps and bounds different. Oh, Kenny King is about to do something to my family here, if my memory serves me correct. That's just inappropriate. Just so inappropriate. And I'll try to keep it PG. But um, I believe he puts his hands in his pants and then flicks his sweat residue at uh, my family that has a giant Tavenville sign. So that, that'll, that'll be fun. I believe that comes up uh, any second now in his entrance. So... It's. It was just. It, it was going well right from the beginning, obviously. And uh, Kenny, I think, is is about to do it right now, right for the code of honor. Oh, there he goes. He sees my family in the crowd. Oh no, Red. Red. Try not to bring too much attention. Red's a good dude. And Kenny just gotta go right for it. Just fling in the sweat right at my face. That's my whole family. Yeah. 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 This was like the first big event they went to. <laughs> oh, and it just gets worse from here. You know, still rocking the purple. Still rocking the purple through and through. You know, always looked good in purple. Definitely a little multicolored on the wrist tape today, though. And immediately the All Night Express goes to just doing a number on me in front of my hometown friends and family. Hey, Kenny King knew my name. That's good. Almost a huge upset. As Matt Taven and Rhett Titus are in the ring, Sid Reeves had gotten launched to the floor. Man, you know, sometimes I miss that hair. Sometimes I don't. Right now, just seeing it move around, kind of missing it. Oh, Kenny just staying on me. Not letting me have any space. And I can tell like how nervous I am because I just I don't have my head up like I don't 
I don't have that confidence that you see in me now. And, uh, man, you can tell. I I'm hiding under all that long hair. Oh, no, I think we're going to the worst moment of this whole match. Oh, no. Oh, I go for the springboard. You shouldn't have done it. Oh! It's, it was way worse than I remembered. I thought I slipped and landed back on my feet. I had no idea I slipped that bad. Oh, way worse than I remembered. Oh, can we not air this? This is bad. And now I'm so nervous. Now I'm freaking out. Just trying to figure out anything. How about a suplex, I guess? What am I doing? Oh no, he's too far out. Squash! Oh, I just killed poor Rhett because I was so nervous after slipping on that springboard, I just rushed that. Oh. Man, no wonder why I didn't get a job for another two years after this. Three years? Oh man. Nothing like getting a, uh, a you effed up chant in the match that you thought was going to be the reason why you got hired. <laughs> <laughs> Sending right across was Turner didn't see it, but now the All Night Express with the advantage. Paul Turner, miss you, miss you, Paul Turner. You did a great job of keeping me out of the ring. They got tag moves, they got poses. I can't even get a springboard to land correctly. Man, it's a rough night. And I, I don't remember this match going very long. So, at this point, I mean, I'm, I'm really leaving people with a, a great taste in their mouths. At least they're getting the best side of me, you know what I mean? At least my booty's getting plenty of, it, of uh, TV time. Not planned out, not planned out. But a nice, oh, there you go, more booty, more booty shots. Big Sid, make that tag. Make that tag. Make that tag. Oh, no. Oh, let's see that hot boy. Oh, and the... Man, this didn't even go good. I'm rushing all of this. Oh, man. I stole through the neck breaker. No hands. Okay. Okay. We try to we, we we try to make up for it a little bit with no hands on the lion salt. Did it make up for the for the miss springboard? Have you guys forgotten about that already? Because I still have it. It's been ten years. Oh. Yep. Yep. Wasn't in position correctly for those knees either. Doing great, doing great. Not obviously not nervous, not letting it get to me at all. Fighting back, fighting both men. With a two-on-one advantage, too much to take. Oh. oh. Man, this is making me miss the All Night Express. Hey, they missed the first slap. All okay? right, let's all think about that instead of the springboard. Oh, I didn't know I took the Royal Flush. Damn. Friends and family came all the way out for that. You know, I got pretty down after missing the springboard. I thought everything, as far as my chances with ROH, were over. I mean, it did delay them for, for a year or two, or even three, actually. Um, but Kenny King actually said something really sweet to me after this match. He said, in my second match, I went for a springboard just like that and slipped. And everyone started chanting, F-I-P, F-I-P, Adam. And uh, just were, you know, trying to tell him that you weren't ready for, for Ring of Honor. And he just kept at it, and he, he finally got on the main roster. And um, did Kenny think that one day I would be a Grand Slam champion and win the world title at Madison Square Garden? I'm sure not after that performance. Matt David has done it! Oh!
Unbelievable! But, you know, I, I got my legs under me the next couple times in Ring of Honor. You know what I mean? Let's watch some of that. Please, let's go. Please, right now, go to YouTube and watch a good match of mine. Just for me, okay? I hope everyone out there is safe, and hopefully I see everyone soon.